Gentlemen, we are. This is my best side. It's the best profile. That side. What's that? Sorry. That's my best side. This side. What about the What about the other side? It's not. It's not quite so good. Okay. What, what's the difference? <laughs> what side do you prefer? What side do you prefer? That side pulls blokes. That side. That side. That side. Um, I'll meet. I'll meet you in the middle. All right. Yeah. No, that'll do. Ladies and gentlemen, Uncle Dean has just surprised me. He just said, Danny. What is it you said? It's a belated birthday present because I felt a bit ashamed of not buying you a drink when we went out on your birthday and because I'm always a bit short. So when I was sorting some CDs out, I put some to one side, what I thought you may like, and I put, left them all in this bag about a week ago. And oh, superb. And locked, it's a couple sealed. Um... I've not played it, some of them. Oh, they're, wow. They're not been played. Red Hot Rockabilly. That's Excellent. Compilations. I know you Is like it? Rockabilly music. I do like Rockabilly, yep. And... And what we got here? Oh, I love Elvis. I've never played it. Yeah, that's good. Because I've got all them songs, you see. I, 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 I accidentally put something like 99p bid on it, and won it, and 150 postage, and that's a double CD. These are presents to me from Uncle Dean. Thank you, Uncle Dean. Oh, wow. Etta, Etta, yeah. I don't know much about Etta Jane. Tell me about her. Chess Records. What's this about? What, tell me about her. What's... She's one of the best fucking singers ever. Is she? Uh, James, yes. Chess Records. When when the blues was fading out, Muddy Waters. You know, have you seen Cadillac Records? No. Nope. Chess Records? No. Nope. Leonard Chess... <laughs> Um, and his brother were Jews, and they weren't racialist, you see, and they they set chess records up just to record blues music, and Muddy Waters become best mates with Leonard Chess, and he found all the talent for Leonard Chess, and he was in the studio, he used to call everyone motherfucker and all that, and that. And All from Etta James. Etta James, he fell in love with Etta James. She was a heroin addict and a prostitute and an alcoholic. Um, and he fell in love with her and he left her his house. What his, year was that? What years? Etta James goes back to the late 50s. See, a soul music. I want to get into soul, that. Nice. Soul, gospel and soul. Oh, wow, the small faces. I love the small faces. Mm. Excellent. Small faces. What can you tell me about that, Uncle Dean? It's got everything on there, but all or nothing. But the other one, I'll give you for the car. It's got all or nothing on there. Oh, is that it's for the car? Sold. Yeah, that's yours as well. You can keep that. Keep more for the car. Yeah, I've got a box set. I've got everything by the small faces. No point me keeping all these discs. They're just cluttering up. And if you you like the music, you might as well use them. Well, what a very nice man, Uncle Dean is. This is my birthday present from Uncle Dean. Oh, we got a Capital Rockabilly Party party. It's part one, two and three. I bought them in HM MVC in Crouch Street in the 1990s. I was a member of the club and they have imports. Wow, you are a lovely man, Uncle Dean. There's some what a lovely, genuine stuff guy. there. Known stuff, like Gene Vincent. But it's, most of it's obscure stuff you probably haven't heard. It's all on the Capitol label. Wicked. Ricky Nelson will be on there. Oh, we've got this, that's the part one? Yes, yeah, one, two and three. Part three. That's not three, it's a different one. That's all more rhythm and blues. All right. Fifties, rhythm and blues, big band swing. Oh, the who? Yeah, it's not music, it's an interview, documentary. They're talking about the group. Biography. S superb, we love the who. So, wow, what a lovely birthday present. I've got a few more here. Oh, Chuck Berry. We love Chuck Berry. Is this... Yeah. What well, sort I've, of... got, I've, got, I've, I've got the chess box set. Everything he recorded on chess records on the box set. So there's no point me keeping all these bits and pieces like that. Because oh, I've got them all. Just... Uh, uh, Elvis again. Yeah, I love Elvis. I think that one's more of his slow love songs. That other one's all rock and roll from the 50s. That's more like, as it says, always on my mind. It says it there, the ultimate love songs collection ones 
That's a double one, the rock and roll one. That's all 50s rock and roll. And that's more, that's his softer stuff, his ballads. And you know I love my reggae, and there is yeah. Bob Marley. So it ain't and even been opened. Sticker on. <laughs> and it ain't even been opened. Look at that. So, ladies and gentlemen, this is a video about me getting a present from my Uncle Dean. And I thought I'd make a present because I wanted him to explain what all the CDs meant. Because he's very musical minded. And he's obviously given these to me because he knows I like this music. And even though some of it I don't understand, that was the roots of the music that I now love. Well, I think, because you won't know a lot of these singers on here, but I think you'll no. like them. It's all that stand-up bass stuff. I know you like that. I do. Have you seen some of my new Harley Quinn stuff? Whereabouts? Calendars. Oh, like, yeah, like look. Like Queen HMV. Oh, let's have a look. Oh, yeah, look. She's in cartoon. I bought two. One to keep sealed and one I've, I've started to cut the posters out and stick on the walls and that. They all look like Harley Quinn. They are Harley Quinn. All different... Harley Quinn ones, you know, ones on the game consoles and yep. Suicide Squad ones. Wow, you've really got into this. She's good. She is. Margaret Robbie is it brilliant. Oh, you gave me that book, didn't you? Which one was that? This one here. Yeah, they've still got it, nature, but it's free, and they're me. It's yeah. music paper, it's free. This I've got, film... I've got a couple, so I'll cut them out and put them... Very, very effective. So, Uncle well, Dean, on film, thank you very much for my birthday present. You thank got, you very much. You, you ain't got that Lucasade virus, have you? Or have you got Coca-Cola virus? I'm I haven't. You now. can trust me. You haven't got to wash your hands with me, Uncle Dean. Thanks for my present, Uncle Dean. We love you. Shine on Uncle Dean. And all this, just because he's my uncle. Shine on Uncle Dean. Shine on Harley Quinn. Oh, and shine on each and every one of you because you're all amazing. And we're not drinking alcohol and we're not watching music. Look, we're watching a program. We watch high fire equipment. Yeah. Retro stuff. Education. We are watching educational films about tapes. Ain't we interested, in Uncle Dean? Yeah. See what you get with me and Uncle Dean. We shine on. Yeah. Exactly. That's what we are. What's the point of shining off? No, there's no point. <laughs>